Hey and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, I'm showing you how to create a mega menu with the help of Jet Menu plugin. Here is how your menu is gonna look after we are finished with creating a mega menu. As you can guess, the first thing you need to do is to go and download and install Jet Menu plugin. Once you have done that, go to Appearance, Menus, and create a new menu. There's gonna be a base for your mega menu. Here we go, we have created a menu. Let's assign it as a main menu instead of my current menu and save. Here we go, I'll fill it up with the pages. Here it is, and let's save. And just go to this page and refresh. So this is how it's gonna look. No style yet, no mega menu. We're going back to our dashboard. And now to enable some styling options and enable a possibility to create a mega menu, we have to enable Jet Menu for current location. We toggle it to yes and press save. Now let's say I want the home item to be the container for my mega menu items. So first of all, I need to hover over the item that I want to make as a container and click on this jet menu icon, mega sub menu enabled. Let's toggle it to yes and edit mega menu item content. And it takes me to Elementor editor. And now I'm going to use a template that you also get with jet menu plugin. This is called lists. I'll insert this template and what it gives me is a four column layout filled up with custom menus. I have created four custom menus beforehand and now I'll just assign my custom menus to each of these columns. Okay, I guess we're done in here. You also have the styling options, so you can change the look of your mega menu right here. You also have advanced styling options in the jet menu settings, and I'm gonna show it to you later. For now, let's just save the changes that we have done. Press update, and don't forget to press save on this window before you close it and press save menu once again. Now let's go back to our homepage, refresh, and see that our menu is now styled. And when we hover over our home item, we see the mega menu. We see that it is now filled up with the custom menus that we have assigned to it. On your dashboard, if you go to jet menu, you're gonna see general jet menu settings that include the styling settings and some general settings that allow you to tweak and customize your menu just the way you like. And that's pretty much it for this tutorial. I hope you liked the video. If you did, don't forget to click that like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching!